Actually, a traveler named Kakuju is here in this village. Kakuju has been traveling all over the place. Perhaps the traveler knows something. What? Grandpa Kakuju is in this village? You've already met Kakuju? Yes. I'm gonna go find him. You look good. Where is Naraku? I haven't heard anything. The last time I was in Minamo village, I heard that... many of the villagers had been spirited away. The villagers didn't know what to do. Spirited away? I'm sorry that I'm not much help. said that an empty stomach is the best spice. I want to eat some meat. You like meat, don't you, Shippo? Yep, I like meat and tofu, too. Really? Tofu, too? And I like fish, and I like rice balls, tofu pockets, and baked potato. There's lots of things you like. Talking about it is making me really hungry. I want to find an inn soon and get some food. Okay, let's run to the inn. Hey, Shippo, don't push me. If we're late, there might not be any food left. We have to hurry. <laughs> oh, Shippo. Shippo's really wound up. He's usually very adult-like, but at times like these, he's definitely a child. I wonder if I had a younger brother, if he'd be like him. I'm cleaning right now. You're in the way. Get out of here!
Ooh, a girl. What a young girl. Whoa, why so excited? It's kind of creepy. Lately, all the girls in the village have been spirited away one after the other, so all we have left are old ladies. What? So what am I supposed to look at when I'm walking around? Miroku. And all the young men have disappeared, too. That's fine. I don't care about that. Miroku! wanted to sneeze. Yeah, after all, it did land on his nose. Shucks. That's the biggest dragonfly I've ever seen. Don't be sad. I'm sure another one will come along. You think so? Yes. And next time, I'm sure Inuyasha won't sneeze. Okay, next time I'm definitely going to catch it. You're looking for an inn? Well, actually, we are an inn. Honey, there's people here who need a room. Customers, why are you getting flustered? Quickly, bring them inside. I'm sorry about that. It's been a while since we've had guests. Well, since everyone is staying, I'll prepare a big room for everyone. Why are you being so stupid? Of course, the male guests and the female guests will be separate. Use your head. What? They'll be lonely if they're all separated. Hmm. These two don't seem to get along well. No, I don't think that's the case. <sighs> I don't get it. You don't need to understand this sort of thing yet, Shiva. Yes, if you understand it, you'll become like the monk here. What do you mean by that, Songo? I don't understand, but I do know that Songo and Moroku get along. What do you say? Yeah, really, Shippo. Huh. Treating me like a child. There's lots of things that I know. It looked like Shippo was mad. The big room is this way. Please, leave your stuff and make yourselves at home. We finally arrived. Oh, Inuyasha, don't be so careless. Who cares? 
We're in our room now. Well, at least put your stuff away. Kagome looks so happy. Happy? Isn't she mad? Uh, yes. But even so, she's happy to be looking after Inuyasha. Well, now that you mention it, her voice sounds angry, but she's smiling. I don't get it. You don't have to understand. You're too young to understand the chemistry between boys and girls. I'm not a kid anymore! I'm an adult! Songo, you are very skillful. Are you talking about the way I care for my weapon? Yes, you are also very diligent. I'm amazed at how quickly you can sharpen your blade. Whenever you have a spare moment, you're taking care of your weapon. She's certainly very skillful. It's a habit. I've been doing it since I was a child. What? Hey, can I sharpen your weapon too? Okay, but don't hurt yourself. If you're gonna let Kagome do it, let me do it too! I think it's a little too early for you, Shippo. Yes. It would be awful if you hurt yourself. Yes, you have to wait till you get a little older. That again? You guys all think I'm still a kid. That's not what we mean, Shippo. Whatever. I'm going out for a bit. Come back by dinner time. Shut up, shut up, shut up! I'm not a kid anymore. That's it. I don't want to be with you guys anymore. I'm running away. Run away from home? That's impossible because this is an inn. That was good, Moroku. Uh, you're all making fun of me. Just you wait and see. I'm going to go after Naraku by myself. Shippo? He's become grouchy. Whatever. He's still such a child. Inuyasha, don't say that. Poor Shippo. I remember going through the same thing. I wanted everyone to respect me as an adult, but no one would. What should we do? I heard him without thinking about his feelings. I'll go check on him. I finally found some game, but it's just a baby fox. Well, I might as well see what fox tastes like. What? Are you the one that is causing everyone to be spirited away? So what if I am? You're just a kid and you're standing up to me? What can you do with that little body of yours? Ah! Uh, everyone treats me like a kid! They won't get away with it! Oh, yeah? Let's see what you've got. What are you trying to do to Shippo, demon? Now a little human girl has shown up. If I eat the girl and the baby fox, I may get full. I won't let you eat me. Shippo, leave this to me and go call everyone. <laughs> Shippo? I'm gonna get him by myself. Stand back! And watch me! I can't stand back and watch you. I'm gonna kill him and prove to everyone that I am an adult! Me? 
anymore. But this road goes straight ahead, so I should be able to catch up to him. I have I was waiting for you. Utsugi, what are you doing here? I will have your soul. My soul? You can't just do that. Kanna, take her soul. Give me your soul. Don't resist. Forget about everything. All your sadness and your pain. I won't forget. I... What? That arrow! I finally found you. Tell me where Nuraku is. Huh? A priestess? The power of purification. It's you, Kikyo. Kana! Get back! almost sucked out by Kanna. And then someone helped me. Shippo! Oh, I need to find Shippo. Where am I? If I ask the priestess, she should be able to tell me. I think her name was Kikyo. Look what I found! It's beautiful. 
You're awake. I'm sorry. I was just thinking. It's beautiful. Beautiful? That's a strange thing to say. Sorry, Kikyo? But it is really beautiful. It's not beautiful. This light... Never mind. If you can move now, you should go. Okay. Thank you for helping me. I'd like to ask you something. Did you see a little boy around the area where I was attacked by a demon? Kikyo, I found you. Your soul. What are you saying? Get back! They're being controlled by Kana. They have been ordered to find us and capture us. Give me your soul. Run for it, Kikyo! We have no choice! Come! Are you okay? Yes, I'm fine. How are you? I'm fine, I think. That light that you said was beautiful, that is a dead person's soul. I am collecting souls, something that normal people wouldn't find a use for. Kikyo. Now that you understand, leave me alone. Soon the villagers will be coming after us. Now, go! Even though you aren't human, you still helped me. I can't leave you here. It wasn't my intention to help you. I just wanted to find out where Naraku is. Huh? You're after Naraku too? Now, I remember the time when Kanna was after you. Is there something between you and Naraku? Well, I don't really understand it. But the fact is... I see. That's why I need to go after Naraku, too. But first I have to find my friend. Are you talking about that little boy? Yes. I think of him as my little brother. I wanted to keep him safe and be able to get along with him. But somehow I hurt him by thinking that way. So he ran away. I wanted to tell him I was sorry. And I wanted to tell him that I think of him as a very close friend. I see. I can feel the purity of your feelings. It will be okay. He will understand how you feel. I feel much better now that I've talked to you. But you should go quickly now. I'm sure your friend is waiting. Okay. Thank you, Kikyo. You are welcome. Bye! Shippo! Huh? I'm so glad you're here. I was so worried. Because I'm a child? No. I'm sorry. I didn't think about your feelings. I only thought about my own feelings. But I consider you my really cute little brother and a very close friend. Please come back. I'm sure everyone feels the same way. Friend, huh? If I think about it, I was being really childish. So, will you come back? When I'm not with everyone, I really worry about them. Shippo. Oh, yeah. I have a candy. I kept some so that I could give it to you. Your intent is very transparent, but I'll take it anyway. Mmm. Mmm. This is yummy candy! Why are you wasting time here? We should get back to everyone. Yes. Thanks for coming to get me. I've been really lonely since I left you guys. 
I guess I really do miss everyone. No matter what, we're all important friends. Yes, we're all friends. We need to stay together. Whoa! Let's see who can get there first. Wait, Shippo. What? Actually, I didn't tell anyone where I was going when I went to look for you. What? So you came here by yourself? That means you don't know where they are. No. I don't know. I'm sorry. You mean we have to look for them first? I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. So, this is where you guys are? Hey, everyone. Not only Shippo, but you also left. What did you expect us to do? I'm sorry. No, it was my fault. Never mind. I'm glad you're both safe. Yes, now we can go after Naraku again without any worries. Yes. I'm sorry I inconvenienced everyone. I won't do it again. Hey, where are you going? I'm going to look for Naraku's henchmen. Kikyo! You look happy. I guess you said what you needed to say. Yes. Thank you so much, Kikyo. Is that you, Kikyo? Kikyo? You know Kikyo? It's been a while, Inuyasha. Kikyo, why are you here? What is this about? There's no reason. <clears throat> what is this about? Kagome is acting strange, too. I'm sure we'll meet again. Kikyo! I think it would be best if we went back to the inn first. I agree. Why were you with Kikyo? Because she helped me. Is that right? Kagome, don't let it bother you. I know. Thank you. Kagome... I... That's okay, Inuyasha. I'm gonna go take a walk. Inuyasha, aren't you gonna go after her? Um... What happened between Inuyasha and Kagome? Songo? Can I ask you about Kikyo and Inuyasha? Well, it's not really our business, but they used to be close friends a long time ago. Really? But you can't blame him for not being able to make up his mind. Inuyasha must have been pretty surprised himself, having his supposedly dead friend suddenly turn up. But it's a sad story. Yes, it is. It's much easier when one can make up their mind. For everyone. Including me. Sounds like you have some troubles, too. Oh. No. It's nothing. What's the deal between Kikyo and Inuyasha? What's their relationship? I'm not sure, but it's a messy triangle. Do you mean that Inuyasha and Kikyo used to be together? I don't know the whole story, but... Even though he has a great girl like Kagome, he manages to be a real idiot. What's the deal between Kikyo and Inuyasha? What's their relationship? They were close friends before Kagome came along. Wow. Seriously? They were bitterly angry at one another, and it cost Kikyo her life. It was all part of Naraku's plan. After that, Kikyo came back to life. Kagome is Kikyo's reincarnation, and it was the power of Kagome's soul that allowed her to be revived. 
Their fates are still intertwined from that event. Does Inuyasha care for Kikyo more than Kagome? He still has feelings for her. There's no doubt about that. Poor Kagome. That must be so hard for her. Inuyasha realizes that. Still, there are some things that can't be rectified, even though the person realizes there's a problem. It just can't be helped. Hmm. Everyone told me about Kikyo. Kagome means a lot to me. But I can't just abandon Kikyo. Inuyasha. Kagome. So this is where you were. Uh... Sounds like you heard all about Kikyo and Inuyasha. Uh... Yeah. Don't go worrying about it. I really care about Inuyasha, even though he still has feelings for Kikyo. That's all. Kagome. I always have my doubts. I hate feeling bad about it, but... But I can't pretend I don't feel the way I do. Feelings can hurt, huh? It really helps to be able to tell a friend, like you. Thanks for listening to my stupid story. I'm gonna go back first. Don't come back too late. Okay. Good timing. Come with me. What? What happened? It doesn't matter. Just come. Why are you bringing me here, Shippo? Shh! Look at that. Oh, it's Kanan Utsugi. Naraku is calling us. We need to go to Asagiri Island. Asagiri Island? Oh. Who was that? This is bad, Shippo. The two of us are no match for Kana. She's Naraku's incarnation. So what should we do? I'll distract Kana. You make sure you get away without being seen and get the others. I can't do that. I don't want to leave you here by yourself. Please, Shippo. You have to. With your speed, you can get to them on time. But... Okay, I'll go. Hang in there until I can get everyone here to help you.
which one is the enemy? Give me your soul. In time! Shippo! Kanna! The time has finally come! Prepare to die! Pity. Come. Here 
goes! Got it. I invoke the Shiki 
got it. How'd you like that? I didn't know how it would turn out, but somehow we defeated her. Shippo came and got us. I was so worried when he said you were facing Kanna on your own. In fact, I thought you were done for. Yes. Thank you for coming to help me right away. If you were any slower, I would be... We were all inspired by Shippo. Yes, Shippo was very menacing. I thought you were gonna die, so I did my best. I'm really glad we did it. Really glad. Hey, Shippo, are you crying? I wouldn't cry over this. I'm just really happy. It's too bad that even though one of Naraku's creations was here, we weren't able to get the information about Naraku's location. She definitely did say Asagiri Island. We should be able to get to Asagiri Island from the port town just ahead. So that is our next mission. Let's go! <laughs> oh, Shippo! I'm so glad Shippo came back. A lot has happened, but I'm a lot closer to Shippo now. I hope we get to know each other better.
Excuse me. Do you know where Asagiri Island is? Mm-hmm. What? That's a scary place. You shouldn't even talk about it. I heard it was uninhabited. What kind of island is it? Is this guy mocking us? Oh! Inuyasha! Inuyasha, let go of the Tetsaiga! We would like to go to Asagiri Island. Get on. Thank you so much. He doesn't talk much, but I think he's nice. I doubt that. We finally made it. It's because of you that we're late. Why is it my fault? Because you tried to help. You overpowered the boat so it couldn't go straight. I was just trying to get us to the island faster. Let's let the fishermen take care of getting us back. Okay, Inuyasha? Damn. Fisherman, can you please come and check on us sometime during your break? Mm-hmm. Thank you, fisherman. Hey, a boat! Is someone else here, too? If there's another boat here, there must be someone else here, too. But I wonder who. I can smell Kikyo. Kikyo? Why would she be here? This one. I'll take this one. This one. Who are you? 
I wonder if it's because of this guy that there aren't any people on this island. But he's not very big. Shut up! Don't call me small! I don't have that much self-control. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! You're wasting my time. What is it now? We're in a hurry, so if you have something to say, say it. You'll regret talking to me like that. See this road you're standing on? Well, underneath it, there's a whole lot of explosives that I planted there. <sighs> Actually, it does look like it's been dug up recently. If I like this fuse, you will be caught in the explosion. So, are you scared? Tell me you're scared. I'm scared. I'm really scared. So you won't say that I'm small anymore. I won't, I won't. I won't ever say you're small again. Ah, you said I'm small. You said it. Oh no, I did. Shippo? I'm okay. Uh. Hmm. Shippo? Uh -huh. You can't move? I don't think so. I think I got hit during the explosion. Try not to move. Please, just rest. Okay. I'm relieved you're not hurt. Thank you, Shippo. Where could they have gotten to? <gasps> that voice! It's Cobra and Utsugi! Run away! What? You have to run away by yourself! But what will happen to you? If you go by yourself, you'll be able to get away! I can't run away by myself! But if you kill Utsugi, you'll disappear! Shippo! What should I do? I won't run away. What are you doing? I'll fight. I won't run away. There's no way I'll leave you here wounded by yourself. What are you thinking? Stop it! Run away! I found you. So this is where you've been. Honestly, you've wasted our time. Shippo, I'll protect you. Come on, little girl. You're pathetic. A sacred arrow? Kikyo? It seems we won't be able to have a nice long chat. Let's go. Indeed. Damn, this group is a waste of time. Kikyo, thank you. I didn't come here to save you. What do you mean? Are you okay? What were you thinking? What am I supposed to do if you die? I know. Uh, uh, 
I still can't move. Kikyo! Are you hurt? He was trying to save me, and he got thrown by the explosion. I see. Here, take this. What is it? Medicine. Swallow it, and soon you'll be able to move again. Thank you, Kikyo. Naraku is on this island. Prepare yourselves if you intend to proceed. Shippo, take the medicine Kikyo gave you. I hate medicine. Well, you won't get better if you don't take it. Now open up. Water. Really? Then this medicine will definitely work. Yes, I think it will. I feel like my mom is here. Shippo. There they are, in the shadow of that rock. So this is where you two were. We were looking for you. We were worried because you were thrown by the explosion. Are you two okay? I'm fine, but I'm not sure about Shippo. I'm fine now. That's a relief, seeing you safe. Never mind that. More importantly, it seems that Naraku really is here on this island. Let's keep going. Shippo, are you sure you're all right? Yeah, I'm totally fine. Well then, shall we be off? We're off to defeat Naraku. Look what I found!
Mitsugi, Kagura, I'm gonna destroy you this time. What is going on? It looks like they're calling us. Naraku may be nearby. Or it could be a trap. Yes. But all we can do is go and find out. What? It's a dead end. That's strange. I'm sure Utsugi and Kagura went this way. I can see their footprints here and over there. Weird. I wonder where they disappeared to. There are no more footprints. Does that mean they flew away? But why didn't they just fly away in the first place? I don't know. Hmm. How strange. What is that? Everyone, be careful. Damn, it's a trap. Huh? Nothing happened. What is going on? It must be a secret door. If you stand in front of it, it opens. I think that's how it works. Interesting. No use standing here in awe. We found the door, so let's hurry up and get in there. Yes. It doesn't look like there's anywhere else to go. Let's give it a try. What's that noise? It's coming from over there. Is that the wind? No. I think we should proceed with caution. What are you doing? Kohaku, I can't let you kill my friends. Then I must. No, you can't, Songo. Kohaku, I'm sorry. Sister.
again. Kohaku remembered Sango. Is he himself again? Yes. At the very end, something got through to him. I think it was Sango's love for him. That's why. I think so. He used all of his strength to free himself from Naraku's spell. That's why he fainted. What will happen to him? things stay this way, sooner or later he will come under Naraku's spell again. No! Don't despair. We'll destroy Naraku before he can do that. So, if we destroy Naraku, the spell will disappear. Yes, if we destroy Naraku, Kohaku will be free of the spell. That's right, as long as we destroy Naraku. Kilala! He's a good boy. Please, take him to Kaede's village. Now there's nothing holding us back. Right, Songo? Songo? I'm sorry. Huh? I've caused so much trouble because of Kohaku. Songo, don't be silly. Well... Don't you remember what you told me? We're a team. A team supports each other in sadness and hardship. Thank you. That's all right. Okay, let's go. We need to destroy Naraku for Kohaku's sake.
Hey, what's that smell? What's this? Oh no, it's explosives! The door! No, it won't open! This one won't either! Is this a trap? Demon from before. Huh. You uh, I'm sorry. You idiot! You make fun of me! I'll show you something! The walls of this room are packed with explosives! This time, you won't escape! I love the sound of music when they're excited! What am I gonna do to you? If you value your life, open the door! Yeah, Inuyasha is far more dangerous than explosives when he gets angry. Damn you! I'm gonna kill you all! Hey, calm down! Shut up! It's all your fault! Come. 
it must have been Kagra. But why did Kagra do that? I don't know what Kagra is up to. But those explosives may ignite at any moment. We should get out of here. What can we do? The door! Our prayers are answered. I bet you weren't really praying. There's no time for this. Let's get out of here. What is this? It looks like it was a demon. It's scattered everywhere. This is spooky. Shippo, are you afraid? Um... Wait, someone's over there! Naraku was regenerating himself. These are all the leftovers from the demons he consumed. Fisherman, what are you doing here? Are you the one that opened the door? Who the hell are you? What? I was controlling him. Dance of the dead! Stop, Kagra! Hey, wait a minute. I don't plan on fighting you guys right now. What do you mean? Aren't you looking for Naraku? Well, then I'll take you to him. What? It's up to you to trust me. Kagra, what are you up to? Can't you tell by looking at all these discarded dead demons? Even if it was a part of him, Naraku uses and throws things away. Are you trying to say that you may end up like this one day? I just want to be free. So that's why she had the fishermen bring us to the island, and why she protected us from that demon. But she is Kagra. Can we really believe her? What should we do? Okay, let's believe Kagra. Do you think it's okay? It is Kagra, you know. I know. But when the demon had us trapped, we would have died if she hadn't saved us. Yes, and I can understand what Kagura was saying. She does have to deal with Naraku. Are you for real? We're gonna let her join our team? Hmm. Are you afraid of me? What did you say? Kagra! Please, Inuyasha. I think we should believe her. Fine. I'll believe her for now. I'll keep an eye on her. But remember this. If I find out you were lying, I'll kill you. Thank you, Inuyasha. Okay, lead the way. Follow me. Is this a secret door? What a weird place for a secret door. You can't see anything but dead bodies here. Unless you know that the door is here, you'd end up walking around in circles. Sounds like one of Naraku's traps. All right, it's just ahead. Why do you want to destroy Naraku? If you want to be free, why don't you just run away? Because he possesses my heart. If I betray him, he'll destroy it. Your heart. It makes me feel sick thinking about it. I guess that makes it very difficult to betray Naraku. Kagra. Hey, don't get me wrong. This is just a business. After Naraku is dead, we'll be enemies. Then stop jabbering and take us to Naraku. We're already there. What? This is Naraku's room. He's regenerated himself again to become more powerful. We might be able to destroy him. Might? We are gonna destroy him. 
In just a few moments, we're going to destroy Naraku. Let's do it. Kohaku, be patient. All right, everyone, let's go. We found you, Naraku. Who is that? Looks like you're still putting yourself together. You'll get no mercy from me. Time to die! to kill Naraku. Is he really dead? That was pretty anticlimactic. I'm free now. I got you. <laughs> What's happening? Are you okay, Kagra? Foolish Kagra. You thought you could set me up. <sighs> Damn you. You're supposed to be dead. The hell with you, Naraku. Kagra. So Naraku is still alive! Does that mean that the Naraku we destroyed was a fake? Damn it! Where did Naraku go? <laughs> Can't see me? I'm right in front of you. In front of us? Where? Damn you! Come out and face us! Huh? job of getting here. You deserve to be rewarded for that. Now it's time to die. Shut up, you rocker. Don't waste your breath. Let's get him! Take that! Wing Scar! Such power. The Wind Scar didn't even Phase him. It's because of his barrier. Well then. Oh, overflowing blue sky. Clear these scarf clouds from my path. Backlash way! What does this mean? No. Break the barrier. That can't be. What does this mean? Foolish ones. Do you think I always use the same barrier? Since the rock made himself stronger, it must mean. That means he has a new barrier. Guess you're just a little too late. Now, give me back what I left. Chico 
jewel! Sacred arrow? Did Kikyo do that? You too, Kikyo? I just came to finish the job. Foolish one. In that case, I'll kill you too. Careful, Kikyo! Run away! <laughs> the barrier has been destroyed! Kikyo! Are you all right, Kikyo? Yes, I'm fine, but... If there's no barrier, we have the upper hand. Oh no! Naraku is going to use the shard of the Shikon Jewel! the real victory. Thank <laughs> you. 
that energy, huh? I can't believe it. Die! You'll get what you deserve. Now everyone who has died will be avenged! This is the end, Naraku. Burn in hell forever! Kohaku will be all right now. Naraku, are you ready? I will never forgive you. This is it, Naraku. Raku? We really
really did! We destroyed Naraku! So... It's not a dream! It was a long journey. Naraku, what are you so quiet for? We won! Hell, we did it! Stop it, Inuyasha. You'll wrinkle my kimono. What are you so worried about that for? I'm so happy! Now everyone in the village can be at peace. Isn't this great, everyone? All of a sudden, I feel overjoyed! I want to yell from the top of my lungs! <laughs> well, I was here, so what did you expect? <laughs> oh, Inuyasha. I don't see Kikyo anywhere. You're right. I guess she came just to help finish off Naraku. Probably. Oh. We really did win, didn't we? We all won! Together! <laughs> Shippo. Don't be stupid. That's okay, because it's true. Yes, you're right. Well, should we go back? When we get back, we have to tell Kaede that we destroyed Naraku. Yes, and Kohaku should be there. We should get back there soon. Preparations are complete. Now I too shall. <laughs>